Hello people, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. Today I'm doing some lash extensions, some DIY lash, uh, lash extensions. I have, that was a very unprofessional. I have another video where I did my lash extensions that's like two years ago and I don't do my lashes like that anymore. I have a, a new way so I thought why not do an updated video because that video is probably my most viewed video ever. So we're doing a new one of that. I have my candy right here. I have my stuff. It's just, it's just gonna be a good video. So what you need for this is a very simple, some lashes and glue, and like a tweezer to apply them. These are the lashes that I use. They're like individual lashes, like one by one, like really. I, the lashes that you use for lash extensions. How do I get this thing open? I struggle every time I'm gonna open this. Why is it so hard to open? It's like. So this is what the lashes look like. Let me give you like a little close up. You know, like that, you see? The longest ones are 15 millimeters, the shortest ones are eight. And yeah, I buy these on Amazon. They're really easy to find, but I'll link mine down below from Amazon. These were like, I don't know, $10, something like that. Fuck, I closed it again, I can't get it open. And then the glue, this is the Ardell Lash Type Dark Adhesive. It's like a really strong glue. This is like some strong shit. And then your tweezers. I'm not going to talk too much. I'm just going to get started because, yeah. <sighs> so what you do is just take like a piece of paper or anything like a plastic piece of whatever and you put some of the glue down. I have a little paper towel here on my table. I'm going to put it there. So just pour some out just leave it for like a minute or two to let it get a little tacky and then you start off so for me the lashes i go from like longer out here to shorter you can do however you want it but i start in the center it's just easier that way i don't know why it is and i take like a few lashes at the same time so i don't take one by one i take like two three four and i put them down I'm gonna show you guys. You're pretty zoomed in, so I hope you'll be able to see what I'm doing. Do I have a little mirror? I am so prepared for this. Like, can you see? Fuck, this mirror is so dirty. Yeah. It'll do. It'll do. Focus. I'm sorry in advance. I think because I'm so zoomed in, I'll be out of focus a lot. So I'm gonna try to like keep an eye on the monitor. I'm gonna be like, you know, I'm gonna try it, but I'm sorry in advance. Okay, I'm gonna start off with the 12 millimeter ones in the like center of my eyes. I don't think you're gonna, you see the difference like on camera. These are the 12 millimeters. Yeah, you don't see that, whatever. Yes. So do you guys see I have like a few hair strands? Do you guys even see that? So I have a few there on my tweezer. Dip it in some glue and then just apply it. Fuck, I don't even know how I'm holding this shit. So try to keep it like as close to your lash line as possible, but you don't want it to like touch the skin. So like the hardest part isn't getting them on, the hardest part is to get them straight because they will easily just like meow and you don't want that.
I'm gonna go in with the 13 millimeter ones because I'm going like further out. <laughs> they actually do last for a few weeks. It definitely depends. Sometimes I can wear them for just like a week. I'm not gonna lie, and they're like fucked up. But a lot of the times I can wear them for three weeks, sometimes like three weeks, and I have like up to four weeks. Um, it just depends on how well you take. take what am I saying? And I'm not focused again. Ah, oh, it. It just depends on how well you take care of them. So you can wear mascara, but that will definitely make them last not as long. And also, if you wear makeup, like eye makeup, don't remove it with anything oil-based because that will just dissolve the glue like that. And just like brush through them regularly to keep them looking good uh, because they will like bend and stuff. So they're, they're like a little bit of work to take care of them because... That's just the way it is. It's cheaper and you do it at home so you will have to put in a little bit more effort to take care of them than if you go out and get lash extensions. Also before someone comes for me, you will come for me either way. I'll just say I am not like a lash extensionist. Is that what it's called? Lash extensionist? I don't know and I'm not that anyway and this is just what I do how I do it and it might be wrong it might not be good for your lashes but this is the way I do it I've been doing this for a long time it works great for me and yeah you should do it fuck what everyone sells it's amazing and it's beautiful and you don't have to do anything in the morning you just wake up and look better because who doesn't want that especially when you woke up, wake up and look ugly oh. So yeah, I would say go for it. I haven't seen a difference in my eyelashes. They still look good. They are not like breaking off or anything. And I've been doing this for years, but I'm not a professional or am I? I don't even know where I put that one. Literally, I was like not seeing anything. I was blind and I was just like, and it turned out really good. And if you've watched my previous one, oh my God, that is so cringy. I was talking like a robot. Am I still talking like a robot? I pause a lot between like words, I know that, and when I listen to it, it's really, really, really annoying, but I can't stop doing it. Anyways, when I did my previous video, I was uh, like using the like single lashes that you buy, and this way is so much better. It looks so much like more realistic. It looks like your own lashes, like if you have amazing lashes. No! Something happened, we have a situation. It's all good. Does anyone watch Riverdale? I know that everyone's saying that this season sucks. Am I the only one that likes this season? Like, I thought last season, like season two, was really sucky, and I actually like this season. I like season three, but everyone's saying that it sucks. You guys even see me? I'm here. I'm here. Okay, I'm gonna go in with uh, 14 millimeters on like the outer part. I can't even speak today or ever. <laughs> I feel like I haven't been out of focus a lot, even though I'm out of focus saying this. What do you guys think? I'm like afraid that I'm gonna watch this footage and be like, oh, I'm out of focus 70% of the time. Another tip, because I'm just like full of tips and tricks. I don't like to go too far out with the lashes because that will make your eye look droopy and we don't want that. Have you ever seen, especially when people do those volume lashes, it's just too much and the eye ends up looking like droopy? No. So if you want to avoid that and if you want your eye to look a little bit more like lifted, don't go all the way out. You'll see like right now, the way I put them, my eye looks lifted up. If I go further out, it's definitely going to start looking droopy. So I'm not going to go any further out than this. Just a little, a little something. I don't know what I'm doing. I hate myself. I'm sorry. I'm gonna go back into the 12 millimeter ones and do some more right here, like in the center. I'm gonna go move on to the 11 millimeter ones. So you just place them on the lashes as close to the lash line, like on the actual 
hairs not on your skin and this glue actually smells really disgusting just fyi i actually don't like it too much on the inner part I don't know if you guys can see, so I'm gonna move on to the, like, I'm gonna mix 10 and 9 millimeter ones just a little bit right here. I think that looks pretty good. I'm gonna let it completely dry, do the other eye, and then I'll come back and see if I need like to put any more because once they're completely dry, I can like just kind of squish them together with my natural lashes and it'll look a lot better. But this is what it looks like. I'm gonna let these dry and I'm gonna do the other eye and I'll be right back. I am back. I got dressed because it is cold, but this is the lashes. It looks a lot better now that I have like both of them. What do you think? Let me pose a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna stop being annoying. Um, yeah, this is what they look like. When I'm done, I usually just take a spoolie and brush through them. I do this a lot, and you will have to do this a lot because when you wake up or if you like rub your eye, they might look a little wonky, so you just have to have like a spoolie near you. Push them together. Once they're dry, like, they will be on there, so you don't have to be too careful with them. So once I'm done, I usually just see if I need to add something. This time, I really don't feel like I need to add anything. Anyways, that is it. I'm not going to ramble. This is how I do my lashes. Like I said, you can have them for like a week if you don't really take care of them or you can have them for three to four weeks if you do take care of them. If you want me to do like a full video of how I take care of them, let me know. I'll do that. And yeah, that was it. I really hope you guys enjoyed this little video. If you did, please don't get, forget to give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel because I need you guys to subscribe. Oh, I don't know what I'm saying. Anyways, I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.